Good morning, salutations, and hello, my name is Larry, and this is The Ethical Atheist, and today I want to talk about conversion. Now, um, most of the Abrahamic religions believe in conversion because they believe that you will go to hell if you don't follow their religion. And many other religions also have conversionist beliefs. Any religion that proclaims itself as the one true religion will generally have some sort of conversionist system. And I wanted to talk a little bit about conversion and atheism. Because personally, myself, I do not believe in trying to get religious people to give up their beliefs. And that may seem strange to some of you. But I want to explain why I believe that. Personally, I acknowledge that religion is a great source of comfort and inspiration for millions of people, and far be it from me to take something away from people that makes them happy. And as long as your religious beliefs motivate you to be the best person that you can be and do the most good that you can do, I could care less about the minutia. I don't care if the Amish want to work on farms and, you know, wear stuffy clothes. That's their right. That's that's what they want to do. Go ahead and do it. I don't care about, you know, cultural minutiae like that as long as you are not violating human rights in doing so. I take issue with certain cells of religious people, like the Westboro Baptist Church, for example, that protests you know, soldiers' funerals and causes unimaginable psychological harm to families. I take issue with that kind of stuff. But as long as your beliefs are motivating you to try to be a good person, I really don't care if you believe in God or not. I really don't. It doesn't bring me any sort of personal satisfaction to get someone to give up their religion. And I know how hard it was for me to leave the religious community when I left. It was a painful experience for me because I was feeling alienated, outcast. I, you know, giving up the idea of going to heaven and knowing that you're just going to die and that you're not going to exist anymore. That's Those are painful things to have to face. And so, you know, if it makes people happy for the short time that they're here on earth to believe in God and believe in heaven and let that motivate them to be good people, I don't want to take that away from them. I really, it, it benefits me zero for people to become atheists. And there is no part of my belief system that requires that people believe exactly as I believe or else. You know, I don't think that if you don't believe in my beliefs that you're going to go to hell because I don't believe in hell. You know, as long as you're trying to be a decent person, I really genuinely do not care what religion you follow. And um, I know that this is going to sound a little bit contradictory because I will, in the future, make videos about specific practices that I am against because they hurt people. You know, certain aspects of the Muslim culture over in the Middle East, you know, is very abusive to women is very abusive to children in some instances. And so there are aspects of individual cultures that I disagree with because, in my opinion, they violate human rights. But I take no issue with people believing in God as a concept. So that's my bit about conversion. I don't personally believe in it. I don't personally believe that it enriches someone's life to not believe in the afterlife. But... You know, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Thank you for watching, and as always, may Darwin be with you.